Hello, my name is Richard Wise. Um, I'm a director of Rider Architecture. We're a national company that have been in the northeast for the last 50 to 60 years. We have offices in Newcastle, Glasgow, um, Liverpool and London. Um, we've obviously majored in a whole series of sectors, but the primary skill set that we have, which we're promoting as part of our um, combined efforts with Northern Education, uh, is in education. We've been practicing designing buildings in education for the last 10 to 15 years. Been involved with uh, PFIs, BSF programs, academy programs, and one off private schools and one off public sector schools. The skills that we bring are to do with how buildings should be designed to be flexible, adaptable, and agile so that as your organisation changes the buildings can change with you or they're not a stumbling block to your organisational changes and that's really developed through having a full understanding of your organisations and developing proposals that fit with that. So actually a lot of the work that we do at the early parts of any project understand your needs, understand how you're organised, understand how you could be organised in the future so that what we develop with you is a roadmap that would lead you to a series of solutions and a model prior to any buildings being developed that actually allows you to understand the opportunities that you've got in terms of reorganisation and the building that you eventually put up. So we go about that with a whole series of different tools. It's a very enjoyable process. It's about listening, understanding, challenging and primarily enjoying. Once we've reached a point where we understand your needs, we then start to get into the real nitty-gritty of how you actually develop a series of proposals, how the building would go together, the programme of work that would be required to deliver the final product, the budget and the practicalities of planning applications and planning approvals, building regulations. So there's a very complex process that we can then get into and we don't want to explain all of that in one fell swoop. It comes as a gradual part of the process. So in conclusion, the real delight of being part of this setup with Northern Education is that what we can actually do is get with you very early doors, understand exactly what your requirements are. And it might be that some of it's just about reorganisation of your existing facilities, changing names on door plates. That is cheap, it's effective, it's efficient. Looking at your buildings, are your buildings part of your current problem with regard to student movement? Are toilets in locations that actually encourage bullying and the likes? Look at all those things and then really come up with a very simple audit of what the consequence of your current building, your current building arrangements are with regard to where you want to be. If it actually transpires that what you're really after is a brand new facility, again, that's a fantastic opportunity, but there's a long way to go before you get to that point, primarily because of the amount of money that you've got to spend and how you raise that capital. And that very much depends on where you are in terms of the sectors that you're in. Um, the the conclusion, I think, is that come and have a chat with us as part of this process. We're here, we're a very open organisation and we can help you out. Our first discussions are very much about understanding you and we would do that to get to a point where we could then start formalising some commissions.